What is going on guys? Welcome back to another Dokkan battle video and today we are going to be breaking down the contents of Global's latest data download for July 5th, 2023. Officially two days away from the start of the 8th anniversary celebration. So of course this is a 8th anniversary data download. Now before we get into it, I want to give a shout out to my boy Proton10MG on Twitter for posting all these assets. If you guys aren't already following him, then definitely go ahead and do so. Uh, my goal is to get him to 10k followers by the end of the anniversary. It's a little bit ambitious, but definitely possible. So yeah, go do that. And uh, with all that said, let's scroll down a little bit and start with the first thing, which is a promo movie for the anniversary celebration. So let me just quickly pause the music here. And we're going to full screen this. Okay. Enjoy, guys. Let's do it now. It's time. Prepare for the spirit bomb. Please, everyone, give me all the energy you can. Man, they get me every time with the music, man. It's so, it's so good. Um, so there you go. The eighth anniversary is almost here, guys. Obviously, uh, a lot of focus on the spirit bomb, um, which, you know, is reflected in the Dual Dual Confess characters. And uh, that's the theme of the, you know, eighth anniversary. And if you're wondering why it's the spirit bomb, um, it's pretty simple. Basically, if you stack two spirit bombs on top of each other, like two balls on top of each other, <laughs> um, it, it looks like an eight, right? Two circles. So I think that's where the inspiration for the spirit bomb theme for the eighth anniversary came from. So there you have it. That is the promo movie. That was awesome. And next up, we have the uh, LRs. So as you can see, the release date here is 2038, which obviously is not the actual date. It's a placeholder date because they haven't actually, I guess, put it into the system, right? Or the database, the actual release date. But uh, if I were to, uh, you know, guess or predict based on previous years, then it should be July 9th, um, which is, you know, in four days. Uh, usually it's about two days after the anniversary starts that we get the dual dual confest uh release right so it should be july 9th i could be wrong but i believe it's gonna be around there and uh, the first lr is the fizz lr super saiyan 3 goku and super saiyan 2 vegeta this is the ssr art which you want to see in your summons and then this is the tur we got the lr super saiyan 3 goku and super saiyan 2 vegeta and we also have the uh standby uh, Goku and Vegeta for that spirit bomb finish skill and then the other LR is the uh, GT1 the GT Goku and Super Saiyan 4 Vegeta we got the SSR TUR LR and finally the uh, standby uh, GT Vegeta technically so those are the two LRs uh, one thing you'll see missing in this data download are the uh, Dokkan Festival A and B tickets, which we usually get for Global. And according to Proton, I think he said somewhere in this, um, you know, this, this post here that they are in the database, but uh, they haven't been scheduled for release yet or whatever. So um, we should probably get them in the next data download right before the Dual Dokkan Fest releases. I believe, I believe. So... Um, yeah, it looks like tickets are still going to be a thing. It's just uh, not available here at the moment. Okay, next up we have the banner units, the side units, whatever you want to call them. And uh, hold on, did I turn the music back on? Let me just check. Uh, I did, I did. Okay, we're good. Uh, so one of them is the uh, Super Saiyan 3 Gotenks and Piccolo. 
that is the banner unit for I believe the Super Saiyan 3 Goku and Fizz. Uh, or sorry, Super Saiyan, Su Fizz for Saiyan 3 Goku and Super Saiyan 2 Vegeta. And then the uh, other banner unit is this uh, Tech Ice Shenron and Nova Shenron. And of course, this is the banner unit for the uh, GT Goku and Super Saiyan 4 Vegeta. And then after that, we have this Int Goku. This guy is the free to play login unit for this anniversary. So you'll get him for, of course, the login and also additional copies through um missions right so you will eventually be able to rainbow this guy for free and uh, we did go over his details in the uh part one anniversary breakdown or anniversary preview a few days ago so feel free to go check that out but as a whole he's a pretty decent free to play unit but nothing super special and uh then we have this free to play hercule so this hercule does not doken awaken yet in part one but eventually he will get a doken awakening and uh, an Extreme Z Awakening too um, on top of that, which is pretty standard for anniversaries, right? And then we also have this free to play Int Bobbity SSR and TUR along with a couple of medals. And uh, this dude will eventually awaken into LR Bobbity that has a standby skill that turns him into uh, Majin Vegeta. So uh, all that is coming in part two and also an Extreme Z Awakening. Uh, in part two and part three of the uh, celebration so not something we need to worry about right now but for for now we do have you know the uh, tur of the bobbity and then we have a couple of events here so the first event is the learn with goku intensive offense and defense training and there's two stages the first one is focused on offense and the second stage is focused on defense and you get 15 dragon stones through missions for clearing each of these stages and then we also have the limited event, Pilaf's Pure Tenacity. And uh, this one is basically like an Whis orb event or orb stage style event where uh, it's available once per day and uh, you get skill orb specific to the Power of Wishes category. And from there, we have the revamped Dokkan Ultimate Speed Battle stage. It looks just like the other ones. Wait, hold on. Does it? I don't remember exactly what the speed battle map looks like because it's been literally like five to six years since I've done it, but it's good that they're bringing it back. That's pretty cool. And then next up, we have the challenge event, Ultimate Technique Seize Victory with Spirit Bomb. So this one, we're fighting the final bosses of the Buu Saga and the Shadow Dragon Saga, respectively, right? So the first one is we're fighting Majin Buu. And the other one we're fighting uh, Omega Shenron, and these are pretty tough stages. So uh, have fun with that. And then we have challenge event, when witches backfire, birth of the shadow dragons. We get the first three stages, Haze Shenron, uh, Raid Shenron, and Oceana Shenron. And then we'll get more stages in part two and part three. So we will be fighting all of the shadow dragons eventually through this event. And then next up we have story event, Super Warrior Memorial Goku and Friends. So. Uh, in this one, we are, you know, facing Goku's friends, Yamcha, Krillin, Gohan, Hercule, with more stages coming in the latter parts, just like, you know, most of the other events. And then we also have one called uh, Story Event Super Warrior Memorial, Goku and Rivals, where, of course, we're fighting Goku's rivals or enemies, Piccolo, Vegeta, Android 17 and 18, and Nova Shenron, for now, for now, well, with, uh, of course, more stages forthcoming. So... Those are the new, oh, never mind. There's one more event. I forgot about this one. A Dreaded Majin and a Soul Reborn. We get four stages right now. And this is where we get the um, the uh, Bobbity, the free-to-play Bobbity that once again eventually becomes an LR with an Extreme Z Awakening. And then we have the Fizz Super Vegito Extreme Z Battle Event. This one is... Um, well, I was excited for it when we didn't know the details, but the details are not the best. He is definitely not the most exciting Extreme Z Awakening we've ever had, or the most uh, powerful Extreme Z Awakening. Like, I think he's he's okay, he's fine, but definitely could have been better. I think they could have done a lot more with him, but it is what it is. We got the uh, Super Boot Extreme Z battle as well, so it's a dual Extreme Z Awakening, well... It's two different Extreme Z battles, but of course they came together. They were in a dual Dokkan Fest, so 
um, it makes sense for them to release both at the same time, right? So we got the Super Boo as well, and this guy is actually a little bit more interesting to me. So I'm I'm pretty excited for him. And uh, we got some tickets. We got the 77 Summon, Special Summon 8th Anniversary Ticket, which we can collect throughout the anniversary. And by part, by part 3, uh, if you collect all the tickets, you can get 3 guaranteed LRs on the Special Ticket Banner. And then we also have the 8th Anniversary Rainbow Ticket, which are available through logins and missions. And these can be used in Part 2 of the Anniversary for the Part 2 Banners, or the um, uh, Part 1 Banners, but only in Part 2. So. This is basically free summons on the anniversary banners and uh, an extreme Z Dokkan Festival ticket, of course, for the Super Vegito and Super Boo and some trade jewels. Uh, we got the Red Dragonstone or the God Dragonstone selection, and then we also have the Purple Dragonstone or uh, Premium Dragonstone selection as well. And uh, oh, there we go. It says uh, we, got, we got a question here from got a couple questions actually about the ticket A. Uh, or sorry, A and B ticket um, for the banners, right, for the Dual Dokkan Fest. And uh, once again, Proton said that there should be tickets, so I'm not too concerned about that right now. But that is the data download, guys. Uh, quite a bit to cover, but there's still more stuff um, for us to get, so uh, I believe we should be getting another data download. I'm not 100% sure about that, but I, 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 think, I think it's coming, so stay tuned, but... If not, doesn't really matter. We got most of the important stuff. And uh, yeah, anniversary coming soon. Eighth anniversary dropping in two days. Hope you guys are excited. Um, I will be doing, you know, as many videos as I possibly can. I probably won't be covering it as intensely as I did in previous years, but still going to be more active than I've been recently. And I do apologize for, once again, the lack of activity on the channel. It's just been really busy. It's been tough to keep up with a lot of the new content right because uh like you know my other job which i haven't talked about too much yet but i'll probably tell you guys what it is in the future um it's keeping me pretty busy so yeah anyways i will try my best to cover everything if not then i'll do the important stuff at least and uh guys thank you so much for watching once again a big shout out to proton for posting all the assets go follow him get him to 10k followers by the end of the anniversary and as always, if you guys liked today's video, then make sure to like the damn video. Sub to the channel. Oh my god. Almost uh, destroyed my mic there. Uh, like the damn video. Sub to the channel. If you're new, hit that notification bell so that YouTube knows you want to stay up to date with all my latest content. And until next time, have an awesome, awesome day. I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Video. Signing out.